Hello guys and welcome to a new gameplay video showcasing yet another class that can literally save your life. So in the last video I showcased the Trap Master and how you can use it to outplay full squads and most importantly counter shotgun players. And in this video I'll showcase the Refitter class as it's one of the most underrated classes and definitely deserves more recognition as the best support class in the game right now. So I'll talk about it a little bit and then we'll see a gameplay with it showing you guys how it saved me from certain death. Not just in this game but also other games like the ones you're watching right now. First of all, I'll introduce this class real quick for the new player, how it works and how you can get the most of it. And if you already know this, you can skip to the time shown on the screen. So this class is a support class and its stocks went up significantly after the last balance changes they did to it at the start of the season. Because unlike most of the other changes, this one was very much needed and it was actually balanced and made total sense. And regarding how it works, when you use the skill, you drop a bag of armor plates for you and your teammates. Without an upgrade, you can take one armor plate and after the upgrade, you can take two. The amount of armor plates you have is shown here and you can have a maximum of 3 armor plates. And what they do is basically they give you extra health and you can take more damage compared to other players without it. So it absorbs any kind of gun damage but it's mostly efficient against one shot guns like the snipers and the shotguns. As for the passive, this class is special as it's one of the few classes that has two passives instead of one. The first one allows you to repair vehicles automatically when you're inside them. As for the second passive, it allows you to heal faster and revive your teammates faster which in my opinion is one of the best passives in the game and what makes it better this season other than gaining an extra passive it also received a buff because in previous seasons you get one charge available only but after the buff you get two charges available with and without an upgrade which allows you and your team to have armor plates equipped more frequently and if you want to know more details about this class and all the other changes they did to other classes and how they work then check my previous video i'll leave a link in the description and finally, I want to tell you that this class alone isn't enough to save your life against shotguns. I mean, if you're a shotgun user yourself, then it should be easy. But if you're an SMG user and you're facing a good shotgun enemy, then you need to use the right gun. Because the Refitter class will block one shot only. The second shot will send you back to the lobby. Swear to God. Swear to God, bro. See, I knew this shit. So basically, you need a gun that kills the enemy before they fire their second shot. And sadly, these days, we don't really have many options. The best and most efficient gun is the MAC-10. So if you're serious about winning, then you must go for it. Then right under that, I recommend the Fennec, the MSMC, the Switchblade, the QQ9, and maybe the RUS. But only use them if you're bored with the MAC-10. Now it's time for the gameplay and I'll show you guys why the Refitter class is my main class on Alcatraz these days as I'll be fighting for my freedom. I hope you guys enjoy and let's get started.
I really hope you guys enjoyed the video and I hope it showed you how powerful and beneficial this class is especially in the fight I had near the airdrop and the slap that I got near the end that would have definitely sent me straight to the lobby if it wasn't for the refitter class and it would have been a very bad timing because the last revive flight was leaving if you enjoyed the video then kindly leave a like on your way out thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next one peace